got God. I've got God. I've got God. We should be happier. We're gonna play something. Read something. You should be happier. Hi, just Yada here. Thank you so much for seeing this new piece. In this video, I want to refresh you on how to update your Apple computer. You may have MacBook Air or MacBook Pro or iMac. If you want to update to the Ventura 13.2, this video will refresh you on how to do that. Two things to do before you update. Check to see if your Apple computer is compatible. That's the first thing because it's not all Macs that will get this Ventura 13.2 update. Second, make sure you back up your computer in case during the update there is a hitch you will not lose all your documents or your videos and photos and to back up your computer click system settings click your your name click and click iCloud then click iCloud Drive you can see that iCloud Drive is on you need to click options then make sure you check desktop and documents folders is important so you just click check and click done a longer way to to do this is to click general and back up with time machine you see it says add backup dicks you may have to you will have to you will have to connect Astana storage to do this backup or you just add it to your Mac and use time machine to do the backup. Once you have tackled these two things you can go on to update. And one way to update is to click, again, click system settings, click general, and click software update. You see it says updates available. And it's a Mac OS Ventura 13.2. You can click more info. It will show you the the size, the memory size. You can see for me is 1.55 gig gigabytes. Then from here you can click install now. Agree to the terms and conditions. Click agree. Enter the password of your Apple computer. And click OK. It will start the download. Your computer will have to restart before you complete the update. That's one way to do this.
let me cancel it another way is to open terminal on terminal click you need admin privilege so you need to use sudo so you type sudo software update dash l like this and press enter enter the password of your apple computer see it says finding available software and it tells you that Marco S Ventura 13.2 dash 22 D49 is available again type sudo software update dash i this time and copy from this where it says label copy first of all you need to put opening quotation mark then copy from here you see where it says label copy from here from there to copy it and paste it here use the right arrow key then close the quotation and press enter you see it says downloading mac os ventura 13.2 again enter the password of your apple computer and press enter see it has started downloading it once it finishes you should just restart your computer and the download will complete that's one that's a second way to update I will have to cancel this to show you the third way so we terminate let me know which of these method you used and was this successful how long did it take please give feedback another way is to click the app store and search Mac OS Ventura click you can see Mac OS Ventura click view click get See, he's checking it for you. And he tells you, are you sure you want to download Mac OS Ventura 13.2? Then click download. It tells you how long it will take.
on the app store you can see that it tells you under version history it tells you this was released four hours ago see that so don't think it's old they just released it they just released this just four hours ago and you see the version is 13.2 and it even tells you what a bit about the update security keys for apple id apple id is important is with apple id for example that you can find your apple device if it goes missing see so it's very important is apple id that you used to listen to music is apple id that you used to install app from the app store so it's very important that your apple id is secure and this update will strengthen the security of your apple id then we have fixes for the free from the new app that came in with the last update then there's a fix for voice over so those are the three ways you can update your mark to the latest release i wait for your feedback again may i know which of the methods you used and was this successful did you successfully update your apple computer you can wait around to see to see how it is finally updated one thing to do again before you update your apple computer is to connect it to power especially if you have an an older apple computer you need to make sure that is connected to power before you update i'm using Mac, macbook pro with m1 chip to do this demonstration and my battery is quite let's see how was the my battery is 71 percent so i'm good and apple will not let you update your computer if your power if your battery is like below 50 percent but i recommend is high recommendation that you connect it to power source I'm using Camtasia to do this recording. Once it's time for 
the computer to restart I will have to stop the recording after the restart we will look at it that we will verify the update We have five minutes remaining. see so a restart is required at this point i will have to stop the recording hi Josiada here welcome to the second part of this update video in the first portion of this video we looked at three ways to update apple computer and this second part is to verify the update so we click system settings click general and click software update see it says your mac is up to date and is mac os ventura 13.2 which is the latest update the update was successful one thing you, we can see here is new icloud terms and conditions so we click that it says to use icloud on this mark you must accept the new terms and conditions so we click terms and, and conditions i recommend to really read it and a copy of the update let me try to take a screenshot Why is he showing record is supposed to show maybe because I'm recording it it's supposed to just show capture mm. nice that was what I wanted so we just command c i'll leave you this link in the description is recommended that you should try to read the new terms and conditions does that 
so we check this and click agree does that please give feedback subscribe i like to know which method which of the three methods you're using updating your apple computer thank you sincerely for your trust and your time see you in another such refreshing video